What is up, everybody? It's me, Brandon Horn, and I'm back here with another episode of Let's Figure This Out here on my channel. And we all like to be unique in our own way, and this figure is definitely the case because this is we have a figure of the long story career of Gold Dust, who is here in Basic Series 50. Um, as you can see, it's got a nice two toned attire, and uh, you can see the other figures that are in the set, the five other figures. Daniel Bryan, I'm not going to be picking up. Adam Rose, I already did a review up here on my channel. Uh, the Seth Rollins, I'm not going to be doing a review of. Uh, the Summer Rae and Sami Zayn, I'll try to get in review. I'll see what I can do. And this Goldust is very cool because quite like Seth Rollins' hair, he has a two-toned attire, which is gold on one side and black on one side. And if you'll excuse me for just a moment, I will be opening up this figure so we can show, so I can show it to you. So here we go. I'm just going to open up the figure. Come out of the plastic casing. Plastic is kind of attached to the package, which was odd. I cut this open with a knife, which is probably not the best way to open basics. I do advise you to be careful because the plastic is, is getting tougher, is getting tougher and tougher on these figures. And as you can see, Gold Dust has a very cool, cool looking attire. And see, he's got the two tone look on his. Or so. Um, and then his legs. One of his arms are gold. One of his arms are gold. And the other is black. And see, so he's got the same face scan that we've seen on the Battle Pack and Elite Series 29. He's got the gold hair on the back. He's got the double uh, colored star, black and black and gold. It says Gold Dust on the back, with a nice little line going down to the legs. And you can see it says Gold Dust on either side of the boots. And that is looks very nice you can see even by the neck collar up here it's got the gold and black transition it's got these two little gold ovals and goldish figures no matter what the case whether they're basic or elite they're always fun figures to look at because there's they're always a trip uh to look at and uh that'll definitely be the case with elite series 36 which i will be trying to pick up with the gold dust Review him here on my channel because I love the the, the the fire the fiery face paint design. It just looks so cool, and you can see kind of a mix of like 2009 Gold Dust on this side and uh, 2013, 2014 to kind of today looking Gold Dust. Got the same, you know, it's got the same like Darth Maul inspired face paint that he had before, and he's got the Dustin Rhodes uh, type blondish hair on the back. And that's basically it for this figure. I hope you enjoyed. Um, and I hope you enjoyed this little review. I'll see if I can get any other figures of Basic, of basic Series 50. And uh, the next figure that's coming up here on this channel is another Hall of Fame figure. This time it's the biggest figure I've ever bought, in, and it's Yokozuna. So I will see you guys back here next week with another review on my channel. And after that, I will see what I can pick up. Uh, because that is my luck. That is the line of action figures that I picked up for the past week, for the past uh, that I've done been doing for the past three, that I've been doing for the past week. Um, it's just a, two basic series fifty pickups and an elite Hall of Fame figure. I'll see what else I can get. And I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Link. Uh, no, no, link. I don't know what I'm saying there. Um, and uh, yeah, that's basically it. And uh, you enjoy. I'll stay tuned for more reviews by a U if by your only YouTube wrestling figures reviewer by being reviewed by a middleweight reviewer. Sorry, I butchered it really bad in saying that. But nonetheless, I hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for more reviews by your YouTube wrestling figures middleweight reviewer. And I will see you in the next video. More for missing this in the review. I wanna also give out my my heartfelt condolences to the Rhodes family. Uh, rest in peace to the American Dream. I know it's a late tribute, but um. Rest well, man. You were the American dream, baby. See you guys later.